Welcome to the party. Hmm. Did you try this monstrous question? <laughs> very, very hard, right? Ah, uh, not really. You know what? I'm gonna show you the trick. That's right. I told you this one cost a million dollars. That's it. If you understand this one at once, then you're gonna be, that's right, high IQ. At least 130. <laughs> that's it. Now, you know what? Let's try something very simple first. Okay. Uh, how about uh, one zero? Okay. So two, three, base number four. So convert this one to the base number eight. How about that? See, base number eight. Then, oh, we learned about this one, right? So we're going to change this one to decimal number first. That's it. Okay, decimal number, I don't have to write 10 right here. Okay, anyway, uh, 1, 0, 2, and 3. Now times 4 to the 0 power, times 4 to the first power, times 4 to the second power, so times 4 to the third power. Okay, now the answer is, Okay, 64, this one 0, nothing, that means this one is 8, this one is 3 times 1, which is 3, we add everything, oh, that's right, so 15, right there, okay, then 5, that means 7, there, 75, oh, that's the decimal number, so now I'm going to change this one to the base number 8, right, okay, 75, Divided by 8. Oh, that means 9. That's it. Which is 72, right? So how many left? 3 left. That's it. So now, divide by 8 this time. Okay, so 1 time. The left over 1. That means backward. Oh, 1, 1, 3. That's it. 1, 1, and 3. So from this point, okay, listen to me carefully, okay? This is the for base number 4, just like this, base number 8, maybe base number 16, which is a hexadecimal, okay? So base number 32, so on, okay? So then we can use binary number instead of decimal number, right here. Oh, no more decimal. Okay, now we're going to use binary number, looks like this one on the top right hand side, okay? This is the binary number, base number 2. Oh, wait a minute. That means, think about it, base number 2 to 4, that means 4 means 2 to the second power. Okay, what about 8? That means 2 to the third power, right? That means, wait a minute, base number 4, one digit, right here, that means binary number, two digits. Okay, that means two digits, two digits, and two digits. Also, binary number. Think about binary number, okay? That means, the, let's say, one, 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 one. Five digits, okay? So this one right hand side, okay, one times what? That's right, one times two to the zero power, right? Okay, this one, two to the first power, two to the second power, so two to the third, okay, two to the fourth, and so on. I keep on going, okay? Now, the right hand side, yeah, obviously this one is 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, and so on. Look at this one. Binary number, which is the base number 2, 1, 1. That means the first one, maybe, oh, that means 2 to the 0 power. Oh, that's right. That means 2 to the 0 power right there, which is 1. This one is a 2 to the 1st power, which is a 1, this one is a 1, this one is a 2, right? So, 1, 2. Oh, that means 1, 2, right there. Okay, base number 4, that's a 3. See, I can convert this one, so base number 4, which is a 3. The same thing, right here. Okay, 1, 1, base number 2 is 3, base number 4. So, because simply speaking, just like this one, 3 means... 1-1. One, one. That's it. Okay, so two digits. Okay, binary number, right? Okay, so 1-1. One, one. Okay, what about this one? So that's why first one is 1, next one is a 2. Okay, 1-2, one, 1-2, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, now, this one is 1-2, or this one is only 2. That means 1 is 
disappeared. That means 1 is 0, then 1. Think about it. This one is 1, 2. That's why 2. Now, what about 0? That means all oh, two digits, 0, 0. See? Now, what about this one? 1. That means 1 is okay, the first digit. The second digit is 0. See? Oh, look at this one. Okay, that means we can rewrite this one in binary number, just like this one. Okay? So, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, one. That's it. That's the base number 2, which is the binary number. Now, I'm going to convert this one to the base number 8. That means, wait a minute, base number 8 means, oh, that's right. So, 2 to the third power. That's why 3 digits here, that's one digit right here, right hand side. Okay, so 3 digits right here, that's one digit. Okay, 3 digits here, that means, okay, we can treat this one like a zero, zero, 001. Okay, same thing. So now, okay, I'm going to do it. Just watch, okay? Now, the three digits, then so the first one is one, the second one is a two, third one is four. So one, two, four, one, two, four, one, two, four. So now, okay, one, two, that's good. But four is dead because zero. So one, two, that means together three. What about this one? Uh oh. So one, two, four, two, four, both. So dead. Okay, so one, that's okay. What about this one? One, two, four, only one alive. So that's it. One, one, three. Exactly matched with this one, right? Oh man. Now, real world, right there. See, I rewrote this one nicely, just like this one. Okay, wait a minute. That's a base number four, right? Okay, so this one's the base number four. Then it's the base number two. That's right, two digits. Oh, so every single time you use one two one two one two uh huh from the right hand side right okay wait a minute look at this one two means one two oh two is okay that means one is dead right there see one two two now what about this one one means oh this one is okay this one is a dead okay so one two now what about three that means one, one, both uh, alive, so that means one, two. Say so one and two makes three, right? That's it, okay. It doesn't matter how many digits, like even thousand digits, so you can do. Okay, from the right, uh, left hand side, we can try it from the left hand side, right there. Three means one, one, told you. Okay, what about this one? Two means one, two, that means two is okay, this one is a dead, okay. Now zero, zero means zero, zero. See? So 3 means 1, 1. Okay, what about 0? 0, 0. So 1, 2, that means, oh, this one alive, this one is a dead. Okay, this one alive, this one is a dead. This one alive, both alive, right? 1, 2. What about this one? 0, 0. See? Just like this. Yes, this was the base number 2. See? One 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 zero 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 one one zero zero one zero one zero. Wow, oh, beautiful! Now all we have to do what we change this one to the base number eight, right? That means I told you base number eight means two to the third power. That's why we're gonna change this one to every three digits, so one digit. Okay, three, three. See, all you have to do just count one, two, three. Man, so simple. So three digits, three digits. Three digits. Okay, now, okay, remember, now, three digits means what? The first right-hand side is one, two, next one is a four, right? One, two, four, one, two, four, one, two, four. Ah, oh, beautiful. Okay, this one, one, oh, one is dead, okay, which is zero. So two, four, two, and four, that's good. That's right, six right there. Okay, this one's the same thing, right? One, two, four, two, four, which is six. Okay, this one, one, two, or both dead, then four alive. See, four, one, two, four. Now, one, two, four, two is dead, one and four, which is a five. Okay, one, two, four, this one is a two. So, one, two, four, six. So, one, two, four, all dead. That's right. One, two, four, all alive, which is seven. Oh, look at that. All we have to do is just write this answer down. Then 7, 0, 6, 2, 5, 4, 
six six base number eight hey now we can try this one right on the top two three two three base number four to the base number eight. Oh, piece of cake right okay so three means what that's right one two both are alive okay just like the one one this one is a one zero so you know what i mean okay this one three then it's a one one okay this one one zero oh now you have to use what uh that's right three digit each right okay that means three right here okay three right there then three right there oh this is gonna be zero anyway so now one two four one two four that's how you change this one to the what that's right that base number eight right okay so one two oh that's alive that's right the right hand side is a three right okay three now the next one so one two four all alive which is seven. Oh, that's right one two and four now what about this one one two only two alive that's right two seven three oh base number eight fantastic look at that now hey let's try exactly the same question but base number 16 how about that which is oh six means hexa right hexa which means six now decimal means 10 hexadecimal uh, that's how you call okay so we're gonna change this one to hexadecimal remember hexadecimal means a 16 base number 16 that means we must use 16 digits just like this one zero one two three four keep on going up to nine then ten oh ten wait a minute ten eleven twelve 13, 14, 15, then 16. Oh, oh, 16 means, oh, round up, uh, carry over, which is a 1, then nothing left, right? So 1 goes up, then it's a 1, 0. See, look at this one. This 1, 0 means 16. What about this 1, 0? That's why we get confused. That's why we borrow the letter. Oh, letter A, B, C, D E F then one zero next one is a oh that means a, this one is a one zero uh, that one is a one zero actually one zero should be right here okay so one zero okay you can use either way zero one zero next one is a two zero okay so on okay now this one is a one 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 two then oh uh, right here okay one nine then oh this one is a one A okay so one B okay so on now keep on going two zero keep on going now right here okay so two nine then two a two b and so on so you understand what i'm talking about right okay has to be 16 numbers okay that means wait a minute okay, another word the 16 elements okay that means we're gonna borrow a b c d e f okay then we can use this hexadecimal that's why some numbers so you can see the inside of a computer language they can see like uh, oh one nine okay b f you know zero uh, five uh, c something like that that's a hexadecimal numbers okay now i'm gonna change this one to hexadecimal uh, 16. uh base number 16 means the two to the fourth power that's why every four digits right here i'm gonna cut this one four digits each right here okay so that means four right there another four right there another four right there and four and four and four perfect okay now okay we're gonna count this one like this one the right hand side is one two four next one is what eight that's right one two four eight one two four eight so on one two four eight oh one and eight is gone one two four that's it okay six right there what about one two oh that's three see easy one two okay then oh four is dead but eight is alive see so one two eight that means eleven right eleven so we have to borrow a b b that's it b right there now one two this is a two okay this one one two three again this one one two four eight that means oh one is dead but two four eight which is fourteen okay what's the fourteen still think about it okay ten is a 11 okay so 12 13 and 14 right okay this one's a 
B, C, D, E. That's it. So you're going to continuously you, uh, practice then A. Later, you easily you can remember this one. Okay, E. That's it. The answer is hexadecimal number E. Okay, then 3, 2, B, 3, 2, B, 3, 6. Oh, man. Great. Now you understand why inside of a computer they call always they call a oh, four bit system or eight bit system. Okay, 16 bit, 32 bit. Now they talking about 64 bits. Oh man, color wise, the 128 bits. Whew, this one is only four bits. Look at this one. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's a four bit system. See, but Talking about 64, oh, this one will be huge number, okay? That's what, what about 128 bit later? Oh.